we're in the east wing of the Whitechapel Gallery in what was a former library. And we're surrounded by a remarkable installation by the Portuguese artist Carlos Bunga. A remarkable, haunting environment, partly inspired by the Shakers. His medium is cardboard, and he's created a doppelganger space on a colossal, monumental scale out of cardboard, something very fragile but very resilient as well. And he's painted the surfaces of this additional skin, this building-like structure, uh, with pale green paint, a colour which is reminiscent of the southern Mediterranean country that he comes from. This is an environment which is both enthralling, it has alleyways, it has passages, it has many clues embedded within it, objects of furniture. All the way around the gallery there are tools hanging from a wooden peg rail. And together they are evoking the past, the memory of the library, the memory of the people who once studied here, the generations of immigrants from different parts of the world who named this space the University of the Ghetto. But it's also about uh, a dream world, about our own passage through cities. It's also about the ruins of cities today, ruined by conflict and by exile. But in this installation are also symbols of hope from tools. Carlos Bunga is inspired by the Shakers, an American community who, in the 19th century, celebrated tools, crafts, and making as a form of prayer. And it's the possibility of being active, of shaping your own destiny, that these tools that we're surrounded by give us a clue to. So this is a very poignant, very poetic space created by Carlos Bunga, both as a memory of the past and as a call to the future.